Yeah, this is sick. Hey, what's up? Chaz here. We're in Girona, Spain, and today we get to hang out with Jan Frodino, one of the winningest triathletes ever, now the organizer of the S Grail. We're gonna go check out Jan's cafe, check in with Jan, ride the course, and see what makes him faster. So make sure to like, make sure to subscribe. But for now, let's go find Jan in Girona, Spain. Hey, How's it going? How's it going? Oh, How you doing? I'm doing well, doing well. Beautiful place you have here. Indeed, indeed. Our little cafe, our little oasis uh, away from home where we do some good burritos, some good coffees, fuel up for an epic ride. So this map has just come fresh off the press. Um, I haven't actually seen it, but it shows us the swim out in Cadiz, which is out and back. For those of you not too familiar with swimming, you can always feel like you need to dip back, which you don't. <laughs> it's fine. Like Maybe me. <laughs> <laughs> and then we get to ride along here, which is all the national park. So they've actually got the permit to ride in the national park. And because the cliff drops off quite steep, you're always like right next to the ocean. Uh, I'm going to take you up the valley here, um, up the Indiana Jones Trail, which is cool. Is there a Temple of Doom? Uh, <laughs> I, hope not. I hope not. I'm not sure why it's called that, but it's a, it's a famous one. It's a nice way to get out of town. A bit of single trail, a bit of open road. It's the old Colosseum. This is the Colosseum? It's the Colosseum of Girona. Whoa. So this is where the big boys went to battle. And just in here, it's the first house I ever lived in, in Girona. So you live right across from the Colosseum? Like, I'd miss this. Like, this is kind of yeah. what it's all about. I mean, coming from the highest levels of triathlon competition, where it's like, everything is a razor thin margin. Come in and just kind of shred some gravel. Yeah. Have to be a welcome change. Yeah, and that's the thing, I don't want to, you know, deprive age groupers of their bragging rights. Yeah. <laughs> Go somewhere, just, yeah, it's about getting community involved and sharing good stories, chasing sunrise. Oh man. That's so good. One of my favorite part about this project is like waking up early, jet lag, having coffee, and then somebody who's local just takes you on something like this, where you're like chatting, talking about cathedrals and whatnot, and then all of a sudden it's like single track, go. <laughs> yeah, I just had these ties set up. The boys put up quite a bit of pressure to seal them, and. Uh, that is why we're gonna let out a little bit of pressure. So when I was running the tire whiz system and I was playing around with it, like for me, on these tires, 29 PSI is really what works well. Um, it's just, yeah, that, right, you never bottom out. What and about? I, I like to be that much. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, yeah! <sighs> oh. I can't believe you just rode up there. You see the sea over there? If it would be a nicer day, we could see the sunrise. So that's Catechus down the line there behind that little crest. So you can see the ocean and then the, so yeah. we're going to swim over there and then ride through all this. And that thing that looks like a little bit of nothing is yeah. that thing on the ground. <laughs> that's <laughs> where course. we're going over. You come across the flatlands here. There's a lot of apple kind of vineyard, uh, uh, apple yards and stuff like that. We'll park our bikes there just down the bottom. Oh, like where that little kind of town is right there? Yeah, just sort of like in into the forest <laughs> there. And then we come up this sneaky thing over here. We have a alcohol-free beer zone up here. If you have some connections, then... There you go. <laughs> Woo! You! On top of the world! Yeah, man, uh, you know, you can take the German out of Germany, but you can't take Germany out of the German. So out of all the three disciplines, which one's your favorite? This one? Ooh. Swimming? Cycling? Uh, I don't know, like I gotta say now, I've been loving my bike riding. Yeah? It's just, um, you know, being fortunate to have a few, a few toys to play with every time it changes. But I gotta say, a good swim in the Mediterranean. That's the one. It's always nice, but you know, now I live three hours from there, so it's a little bit further. And then a trail run. Give me lots of fun. Yeah. You just can't do six hours of it. And, no, yeah, it's a bit tough. Stop somewhere and get a bocadillo and, <laughs> and a drink. It's uh, yeah. not the same, but I don't know. I'm fortunate. I love what I do. Yeah. Um, one of those, one of those all the above. I'll check all the above. Pretty much. Yeah. Love it. All right, so we just uh, previewed some of the Scrail course that Hike a Bike may or may not be in the actual race course, but 
Thanks, Jan, for showing me around Girona. Yeah, thank you. The, Thanks for being up for a good time. Yeah, the lesser known parts of Girona. <laughs> Indeed. Make sure to like, make sure to subscribe, make sure to follow the Scrail for all of your triathlon curious needs. But for now, this is Chaz and Jan making you faster. <laughs>